Hi everyone, Miss Sarah here with some more nature crafts and today we are going to turn a pine cone into a mouse. And first I'm going to show you all the materials you need to make this cute little guy. So here are three different mice that I made and we will need pine cones, something to make the ears and face. So you can use acorn tops, buttons, even small seashells will work for the ears. And if you have googly eyes, but we can also use paint, acrylic paint for all the detail, twine for the mouse's tail, and then glue, Elmer's or hot glue, will work to put it all together. So once you have all your materials, you can create your mouse however you like. And you can see from my three that any shaped pine cone will work. And you can also decide if you want to do the face on the top of the pine cone, like this guy, or on the back of the pine cone for this one, which kind of gave me some more uh, space to draw and paint his face on. And you can see this one has button ears. This one has acorn top ears that I painted on the inside as well. Um, this one has a pom-pom nose, but this one I just painted his nose on if you don't have pom-poms. So get creative with your mouse. So I hope you had fun making your little pine cone mouse. And maybe after you make your mouse, you want to make a little house for it out in the woods, um, just like a fairy house out of sticks and twigs and moss. You can get creative designing your own mouse's little house. And in Connecticut, we have different species of mice. We have the white-footed mouse and the deer mouse, and they look very similar. They have a brown back and a white belly. Uh, they're also very helpful in eating the invasive gypsy moth caterpillar. We also have the house mouse and we have a meadow jumping mouse and a woodland jumping mouse. And the woodland jumping mouse can jump eight feet, which is quite amazing for a guy that's just this big. Mice also have to eat 15 to 20 times a day to keep up their metabolism. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Have fun making your mouse and happy nature crafting.